Love him or loathe him, Julian Assange provokes passionate debate. He was born in Townsville, Australia in 1971. Raised by his mother, he was homeschooled and said to be fiercely intelligent and a skilled computer hacker while still in his teens. By 2007, he'd founded WikiLeaks to expose bureaucratic secrets globally. But it was this year that he and the site rocketed to fame with a video posted online showing an attack on Iraqi insurgents that killed both journalists and civilians. Assange stepped the into the spotlight to defend the leak, and the rumor mill so. went wild, calling him a paranoid control freak who slept in a different place every night. He was even named in a rape case in Sweden and added to Interpol's wanted list. At a panel discussion in London, I asked him how he liked the attention. You have become the story almost despite yourself. Um, and I think that, I think we'd all like to hear what you have to say about that. So you want me to become even more part of the story? I do. <laughs> hmm. You know, people say, well, don't you find all this attention on you annoying? Uh, and very difficult. Well, yes, it's annoying. Yes, it is very difficult. Yes, so if it's, it's so difficult, what makes uh, him tick? Colleagues say it's conviction. What comes across is a very firm, very firm belief that secrets are not often a good thing and that society doesn't benefit from, uh, from secrets. This is a man with a mission to keep on leaking. Up next, he says, thousands of documents from some of the world's biggest banks. Elizabeth Palmer, CBS News, London.